Hey there, and welcome to a quick video on how to solve this puzzle door over here that you will find throughout Hogwarts Legacy. Unfortunately, I'm still waiting for the PC version of the game to come out, but I have seen my wife do this on PlayStation 5 already a few times. Now, this door can be found throughout the castle in various different forms over here, but you'll notice that the pattern of animals around it is always the same. It always starts out with the weird sloth owl, the unicorn, the whatever the fuck that is there. Now, alongside this door, you will find these two different kind of like rotatable question marks. One that has one question mark, one that has two question marks. And these are part of a math equation that is shown on the chalkboard in the middle of this door. Now, using this equation, you're going to use these different creatures as numbers of sorts, but it doesn't count in the conventional one, two, three. No, it's it's way more confusing. It's zero, one, two, three. Three. So as a reference, this is something you can find in the game now. You can actually use it on the screen now to solve the door that's probably right in front of you on your game right now. So as it goes like here, this is zero, this is one, this is two, this is three, this is four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, of course, right? So you can pause here, use this to deduce or solve the math problem that is in front of you. So to quickly show you how to do this on a actual sum in the game, for example, we have a 13 in the middle for this one, and we need to solve for whatever question mark is over here. And then we have a 21 with a double question mark, which is obviously to solve the two little puzzles left, like what animal is this one and what animal is that one? So to quickly solve this, we're gonna take this 13, we're gonna minus one, because obviously the 13 is the total of all of the three surrounding numbers. So minus one, it becomes 12. And then we have to minus spider, which is over here, which as you can see on this last page is an eight. So eight, well, 12 minus eight is four. So we know it's four. We need four, which is this thing over here. It looks like an owl on a tree branch, which of course is going to be this option over here. So this one is going to be question mark number one. Okay, so now we need to figure out this second sum over here to find what the double question mark is. And we have 21, 21 minus 13, which is going to be eight. Yes, I took a few seconds to try to figure that out of my head. Be, be, leave me alone. And then we need to minus the three-headed dragon, which one, two, three, which is three, which means our answer is five, which means the thing is going to be the crab. The double-headed one is going to be the crab. So as you can see here, the first question mark is going to be the owl on the tree branch, and then the double question mark is going to be the crab by doing simple math and figuring out the sum like that. And that's pretty much how you do it in the game. I hope you guys enjoyed and are enjoying the game, and thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it helped.